our, our fearless leader, and I really appreciate your dedication, because once we were all out of school, moving on with our lives, doing other things, you were still there, getting up early, <laughs> marching around, teaching us all discipline and uh, musical integrity and uh, all the, the great activities we did and trips we took. It's really a fond part of my memory bank. So um, I appreciate your dedication all these years. Hey, John. So I'm finally uh, able to say happy retirement. It's about time you pull the trigger. Uh, as Sarah said, there are a lot of fond memories of uh, Midwest City High School. I appreciate your friendship and uh, um, example there while I was teaching, although it was a short time. Uh, we had a lot of great really great times, fun on the trips, and uh, playing tennis, and uh, working out together. Little skinny me by Big U, uh, but it was always a great time. Hey John, it's your brother. Um, hey, I want to congratulate you for your 42 years uh, building a legacy in Midwest City uh, School District, and producing bands of renown. Um, I would just want you to know that we uh, I uh, love you, and I know it's a little difficult transitioning back to private life, but uh, we love you, the family loves you, and congratulations. Uh, enjoy your retirement. You deserve it, but uh, unparalleled. No one's going to ever equal your act of service and commitment to Midwest City, Middell Schools, and the Bomber Band. Once a bomber, always a bomber. God bless all you. So as you retire, I just wanted to say, man, I just wish you the best. Thank you for all you've done for me and the Midwest City Band. And they'll never be able to replace you. And so with that being said, thank you for everything. Mr. Davis, Chris McCarthy calling in from Washington, D.C. Wanted to say congratulations on your retirement. Uh, you have supported a whole lot of people in a whole lot of ways over a whole lot of years. Not only in music, but uh, across the board. For me, I wanted to say thank you for letting me balance band with baseball and all other kinds of activities that were really foundational for me to get out there and live life after high school. So thanks again, congratulations, and best wishes to you and your family. We're so thankful for your lasting contributions to not only the Midwest City High School Marching Band, but also Midwest City High School in general. We thank you so much for all that you've done. We hope you have a great retirement. You deserve every bit of it, and we appreciate everything that you've done. Enjoy, and we'll hope to see you around, sir. Thank you for leaving a legacy. Literally, I remember you gave me the shirt off your back whenever we went to San Antonio for a contest my senior year because I left my uniform in my truck. So, um, man, it, it was never unnoticed that you loved us and that you uh, cared for us, and so I just appreciate it so much, man. I really grew a lot when I was in the in the band, both as a student and um as a person thanks to your instruction and um i'm just so excited for you and for this next phase i pray that the lord would uh just lead you into um a great next season thank you so much for everything you've done for 40 years of teaching children young people how to be better human beings and good adults enjoy your retirement my friend thank you Congratulations, Mr. Davis. You made it to retirement. Oh, I'm so jealous. But I just wanted to thank you for um, all your love and encouragement you gave to us high schoolers over all these years. I know we aren't the easiest to teach and love, but you surely made us better humans. Um, I know that you made such an impact on my life, and I can't thank you enough. Um, I hope to be half the educator you are. So I love you and have so much fun in retirement. Bye. Mr. Davis, I don't know where to start other than it's Deputy Milliken, TJ Milliken, but I wanted to say congratulations on 42 years of teaching at Midwest City. Even though I graduated in 99, I always bumped into you or always worked events and I seen you with the Midwest City band doing y'all sing. Hi, Davis. It's Ryan Maxey uh, speaking to you from lovely, sunny Phoenix, Arizona. I just wanted to wish you a happy and well-deserved retirement. I wanted to thank you for 43 years of public service. Um, and I wanted to thank you for all the incredible good you did for me as my band director. 
Hey, John, congratulations. It's Phil sitting here in my office in Bridge Creek. Uh, you always said that you were going to teach until the poop got too high. I guess it did. Wow, getting ready to retire. So what are you going to do now? Enjoy it, play golf, and uh, probably do a lot of swimming and get a suntan while you're out there. Enjoy your retirement and always a bomber. Have a good one, Davis. Hey, friend, congrats. If anyone deserves some well-earned r and R, it's you, my man. Uh, gonna miss the days uh, where we would uh, keep the parking lot safe there at Midwest City High School. I've been gone for a few years, but um, sure look back fondly on those times working with you, my man. And Hello, Mr. Davis. I just want to wish you a happy retirement. I hope you enjoy it now. All your hard work is done. You've made some impact on lives. And yeah, just have a happy retirement. You deserve it, sir. Good job, my man. Uh, happy retirement. Um, the OCD is losing a great one. Um, I know you've put in like uh, 75 years, something like that. Um, it's, it's crazy to think that it's all coming to a close. Um, I know you've been thinking about this uh, for the past couple of years. And um, hey, man, good for you for... Uh, finally taking the leap of faith. So, um, never had the opportunity to have you as a teacher in the band room, uh, but I've had the opportunity to have you as a teacher in life, and you've uh, taught me so many lessons that uh, I will forever be grateful for. Um, love you like another father, and uh, I wish you the greatest retirement you could ever imagine. Mr. Davis, congratulations. 43 years, long time, especially being in one place. Uh, the impact that you made with the band at Midwest High School over so many years. Uh, the riff that those kids would play during uh, start lineups was absolutely amazing. I uh, really enjoyed that time, really enjoyed times we had conversations, um, and good luck on your new endeavors. Congratulate you again on your retirement. We taught together for over 25 years. We made lots of great music, great memories, and blessed thousands of young musicians showing them the joy of being in a band. Hi, John. Congratulations on the retirement. Uh, for you all don't know me, obviously, I'm Bob Goodner, retired band director, and I've known John since the early 80s. Uh, my kids went through his band program. I was kind of wanting them to come to Choctaw, but I knew there's a great band director at uh, Midwest City, so we let them stay there, and I'm glad I did. Hi, John. I was reflecting over the last several years um, that, that I've known you and want to say congratulations to you. I'm excited for your new journey in life. Um, and just over the many, many years of all the ball games we sat through together with our kids playing against each other, then on the same team, finally, thank goodness. Um, and just want to tell you that I appreciate everything that you've done for our kids. I appreciate what you've done for this school. Hi, John. I was just wanting to give you a shout out and congratulate you on your retirement and let you know that it's been great working with you over the last 16 years. It's hard to believe I've been here 16 years. You've been here longer. Um, so usually our conversations would, you know, go around Joel and baseball, just your family and your wife. She's amazing. And running into you guys at Penn Square Mall at the movies or something, you know, it's just, you're such a great guy and a great director. Um, it really is going to be weird looking down on the bomber field and the bands out there and not seeing you. Mr. Davis was uh, a teacher in all things, not just band. I remember when we uh, were in high school, uh, we'd hang out in the band office for lunch. Uh, Mr. Davis would uh, debate with us about politics, even if he didn't agree uh, with our politics, always teaching us something. Uh, about uh, the world in general, not just music. Uh, so uh, he was a teacher about life. Uh, I remember when I first moved to Midwest City, John and Lynn took me in like a member of their family. I remember little Josh following his daddy around the football field during marching season. I remember when baby Joel was born. 
Um, I remember us going through hard times together and celebrating good times together. Those things will stay a part of me forever. And John, as you go into retirement, our profession loses one of its finest teachers. And we all join together to celebrate you and the person that you are and the good that you've done for young people for all of these years. Mr. Davis, this is Brian Ayler. I want to congratulate you on your retirement and uh, never giving me first chair in trumpet. I know you did it because you knew I was good enough, but you're teaching me a lesson to work hard. Actually, I was terrible at the trumpet and uh, I never deserved first chair, so. At the same time, the high expectations you held for us are the reason so many awards were won on the stage and filled. I had to pull out my favorite trumpet that I thought I couldn't live without about 25 years ago just because Joel Mott played one. We don't always receive everything we want in terms of ability, but I'm thankful you provided the influence of student mentors, clinicians, and the opportunity to attend so many memorable concerts to hear what the best sounded like. Thank you for making a difference in my life. Thank you for really instilling in me so many of the values that I still strive for. Hey John, Bobby Fortner here. Just wanted to say happy retirement. Well deserved. Enjoy, brother. Oh, why hello, I didn't know you were there. Hey Mr. Davis, I just wanna say congratulations on your retirement. You've influenced a ton of people over your career, including myself. You've been a great mentor, a teacher, and I just wanna say thank you for everything and. Happy retirement, I hope you enjoy it. You know, most of us have had uh, some time to be in a career now. And uh, the longer you're in a career, you realize a couple things. Um, there are people who are sorta of good at what they do, and then there are people who are really good at what they do. Now, there are a lot of people who, they can't wait to tell you about, you know, their achievements, you know, and their awards, and they like to brag and stuff like that. It's usually those people who are the ones that are just sort of good. But the people who lay back and just that are humble and don't brag, and the ones that let their work speak for them speak for itself, those are the people who are really good at what they do. Man, that's John Davis. Hey, John. Just want to say congratulations on your retirement. I know. Uh... Uh, seems like it's been a long time coming, I'm sure, but uh, a lot of good music through the years. I'm sure, a little bit of bad music through the years, but uh, quick story. I still remember the, the first day I met you, uh, Midwest City, coming down the hallway. You stopped by my office real quick, stuck your head in, introduced yourself, and uh, I thought that uh, it was a linebacker's coach coming by to see me. So there's no way a band director's all yoked up like that. Hello, Mr. Davis. Shane Hawk here. Uh, I just want to congratulate you on a wonderful career uh, in education as well as leading uh, the Bomber Legacy, uh, probably the last piece of that Bomber Legacy that is left from, from our history is, is the band director and, and taking care of that side of things. John Davis, Craig Troxell here. Hey, congratulations, man. 42 years in education. Um, enjoyed my time with you at Midwest City. Once a bomber, always a bomber. Um, did a great job through the years. I always commented how uh, good your bands were and how well behaved, how disciplined they were. They did a great job. All right, how's everybody? Good, good, good. Now, as Joel's father probably told you, his name is John Davis and he is retiring. Well, let me just tell you a little bit about John Davis. He's been teaching for 43 years. He's retiring to work on his golf game and he'll be living in a van down by the river. Now you kids are telling yourselves that you're gonna go out there and you're gonna get the world and you're gonna wrap it around and pull it down and put it in your pocket. But as John Davis always told us, you're never gonna amount to Jack Squat. All jokes aside, happy retirement. Uh, thanks for everything, do the best, love you. Hey, we just wanna say congratulations on retirement. Uh, we hope you enjoy yourself and thank you for everything you did. Gonna miss a whole bunch of smoke on the water and iron butterfly. Once a bomber, always a bomber. Thank you. Hey, Mr. Davis, congratulations on your retirement. You've definitely earned it. 
Um, you know, you've had such a huge impact on all of the kids that have gone through the Midwest City Band program over the years, um, including myself. I want myself. to thank you so, so much for everything that you have um, gave to me or imparted to me and my brother. Um, it has it has been very influential and in what has it what has brought me into the journey that I am in now, which is um, owning a music school. So congrats, Mr. Davis on an incredible year at uh, Midwest City High School. Uh, Greg Bruno here. This is on behalf of the Bruno family. Um, we wanna thank you for all the support throughout the years. Hi, sweetheart. I just wanted to say congratulations on your retirement. This is definitely well-deserved. You've had a great run. Congratulations and feel wonderful about all the lives you've impacted. I love you. Hey, Mr. Davis. Just wanna congratulate you on your retirement. And thank you for all that you have done for all the students over the years. Hey, Danny Davis from Street Outlaws. I want to take just a second to wish John Davis a happy retirement. He's been a teacher for 43 years and has impacted a lot of kids and a lot of people. And if he had to deal with students like me, I'm sure he's ready for retirement. So, John, this is your time. Sit back, relax, enjoy your retirement. Thanks for everything you've done. Hey, Mr. Davis, Landon Harper here. I just want to congratulate you for 43 years of teaching. That is a great accomplishment, and high school would, wouldn't have been the same without you. So, thank you. Hey, Mr. Davis. This is Mike Franklin here. Greetings from Central Texas. Just wanted to send you uh, my video and to wish you congratulations on your retirement. One of the biggest uh, impacts that you had on my life and what I appreciated the most was your ability to take such a diverse group of kids and really get them to work together, um, work hard every day, and really exceed their goals and strive for the very, very best. And that's a lesson uh, that I hold dearly to my heart and that I really appreciate you instilling in all of us. Want you to know you will be missed. Want you to know you've been truly appreciated. You helped me from fifth grade till I was 18. Can't thank you enough for everything. Uh, honor and privilege to work with you here at Midwest City for the past 18 years. You've shown and taught me quite a bit on uh, how to run a band program. For that, I'm truly grateful. Uh, we've had quite a bit of memories here from all of our band trips to contests to you know, those first couple of years of 40 some odd students eating lunch in the office with us. Those are a lot of memories that I'll cherish forever. Congratulations. Congratulations. It's, it's, it's well overdue. Uh, and, and I hope that you, you enjoyed your years, uh, with all of the students and all of the people that you've met, uh, and, 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 and you're happy with the hand you played in, in, in raising a lot of those people or, or, or helping those people grow up. Right. Uh, but thank you. Congratulations. Uh, we I truly, truly appreciate you as a person, as a director. Um, and, and I'm excited to, to learn about what you're going to do uh, after you're done, after, now that you're retired. Uh, so thank you. Enjoy the night. Uh, I wish the best for you. I just want to thank everybody for coming tonight and um, celebrating uh, my father's retirement. It means more to me and to him than you'll ever know. He's uh, always been one of the most humble guys that I've ever met and never an eye guy. I never wanted any recognition for it. But finally, you get the recognition that you deserve, Dad. We love you so much. Enjoy this night. And I told you you were going to cry. Love you, Dad.